This space race is growing more cutthroat than ever before. The momentum is unstoppable, and only the best will emerge triumphant departing from us. Have you ever wondered what the year 2022 might be like? Who will be the dominant force in the space industry? At the heart of it all is a private business called SpaceX, which is sponsored by one of the world's wealthiest individuals. In 2022, how is SpaceX's spaceship storming every competition? How far has SpaceX gotten thus far? How quickly will SpaceX fulfill its major objectives? We feel you must ask all these questions right now, so stay tuned and keep watching as we investigate the answers to these issues. SpaceX founder and CEO Elon Musk has been relentlessly pursuing his visions and dreams to explore and create a colony for mankind's survival, to build a city on Mars, and give mankind's future generation hope for decades. About 20 to 30 percent of the world sees him as a crazy and irresponsible man, but most adore his tenacity, innovative, relentless, and focused mindset towards his vision. Starship test flights have been delayed severely due to the FAA investigation, which started a few months ago and lasted through December 2021. These contributed to the delay of SpaceX Starship's launch and orbital test. However, Elon Musk has made it known that Starship will resume its constant test flight fully by the first month of 2022. SpaceX did not stop all of its launches for the year 2021 as it ended, but they successfully launched their Falcon 9 rocket from Cape Canaveral, NASA's Kennedy Space Center Pad 39A. It marked the 131st flight of the SpaceX Falcon 9, and its 28th for the year 2021. It was a $214 million contract awarded to SpaceX by NASA to fly its X-ray telescope and IXPE to space. Starship is about to fuel SpaceX's most ambitious goals in 2022. Recently, SpaceX CEO Elon Musk highlighted out how SpaceX under development spacecraft will deliver a high fly rate of dozens of launches by 2022. This initiate will allow SpaceX Starships to deliver dozens of payload by 2023 before extending its reach towards more ambitious goals, like sending astronauts to the moon and Mars. During a joint meeting of the Space Studies Board and the Board on Physics and Astronomy, emphasized how the giant stainless steel rocket in Boca Chica, Texas, will soon elevate from prototype development to a fully working ship. It is a massive project that can execute a few of SpaceX's primary goals and ambitions. First indicated in 2017 as a BFR, the spaceship is a stainless steel rocket that measures up to 400 feet long with its super heavy booster. It is completely reusable and designed to make the flight as much as three times per day. It is also capable of delivering over 150 tons of payload and as much as 100 people into the lower Earth orbit per launch. Starship tops the list of the most reusable rocket in the world and is powered by 38 monster engines called the Raptor engines. This Raptor engine burns liquid oxygen and methane as rocket fuel. This also means that astronauts can fly the Starship towards Mars and also refuel by making use of the planet's resources, giving them options of heading back to Earth or to heading to another mission. We can classify Starship as a generalized transport mechanism for the greater solar system, said Musk in an interview. These are all steps toward a greater result and achievement for SpaceX in 2022. Although there are many rumors that Starship will be launching as early as February, the CEO of SpaceX, Elon Musk, has made it clear that the Starship's highly anticipated orbital flight could take place as soon as January 2022. The company built its first full-size prototype of the Starship back in September 2019. In May 2021, it successfully launched and smoothly landed a full-size prototype, SN15, to a height of about 33,000 feet. The next phase is launching the Starship SN20 prototype on its first orbital flight, which will send the ship and booster on a 1 hour 30 minutes trip. It will launch from the Starbase site at Boca Chica, Texas, launch pad, then disconnect from the booster after 2 minutes after takeoff. Then it will terminate its flight along 60 miles northwest of the Hawaiian island of Kauai. Elon Musk earlier planned to complete the launch tower Mechazilla in November 2021, then perform a series of test flights in December 2021, before conducting the pending Starship SN20 orbital test flight the following month 2022, but it was all disrupted by the FAA. From there on, Elon Musk has put many plans in place for 2022, which will outsmart all his competitors. Isn't this exciting? Let's take a quick look at some possibilities prone to happen in 2022. Assuming the 2022 test flights are successful, Musk plans to evolve onto real payloads by 2023. Isn't that going to be fascinating? Although, it is currently unclear whether SpaceX still plans on launching Japanese billionaire Yasuku Mazawa on a trip around the moon in 2023. This mission will also include eight lucky competition winners, which were originally disclosed in 2018. Secondly, if all goes to plan by 2022, the SpaceX Starship will also be expected to land on the moon as part of NASA's Artemis program awarded to SpaceX. However, the agency's administrator, Bill Nelson, stated in December 2021 that the mission is likely to occur as early as 2025. This will finally enable NASA to build a lunar base on the moon. 
Starship is capable of executing these missions because of its maximum transport capabilities of transporting enough payloads and people to the moon to eventually have a permanently occupied base on the moon, Musk said. As long as we have a permanently occupied base at Antarctica, another possibility we should be expecting is SpaceX's primary goal, which is to send humans to Mars. At the 2017 uncovering of the BFR, Elon Musk unveiled and explained an ambitious possibility of sending two uncrewed ships in 2022, and possibly two more uncrewed ships and crewed ships alongside each other in 2024. At a most recent event, he explained that there is a high possibility of SpaceX sending at least two or three uncrewed starships to show that a SpaceX starship can land safely on the planet. He also indicated that SpaceX might probably work with NASA, or NASA partnering with another country, to send astronauts and scientists to Mars. This all paves way for Musk's longtime goal, which is to colonize and build a vast human colony and city on Mars, which he has stated can eventually come to be by 2050. Thirdly, Musk explained that this could also create a possibility of discoveries beyond Mars. He stated that Starship could enable a planet-shifting network, as the ship could fuel at propellant depots on the Moon or Mars and continue towards their journey. Elon Musk explained, if we have a base on Mars with a high demand, you could, you can planet hop, he continued, from Mars to maybe Ceres, to maybe one of the moons of Jupiter, and ultimately to the outer solar system, he also said. Architecturally, it is capable of transporting almost any arbitrary mass to any solid surface in the solar system. We are sure you are amazed and enthusiastic to see all this actualized, right? Well, so are we. The year 2021 will probably go down into the great books of space history as the turning point or a catalytic era. A moment when ordinary citizens started leaving Earth constantly, multiple crews lifted on several different spacecraft, and for a brief moment this month, about 19 people both male and female alike were recorded in the zero gravity or weightlessness of space, and eight of them were private citizens. Astonishing, right? If 2021 can be called a year of civilian space tourism, 2022 could mark the beginning and step towards the exploration and return to the moon, as NASA and the vast growing space industry are yearning to maintain the momentum that has been building over the past decade, which has amounted to an enormous revival and rebirth of explorations. NASA is also striving relentlessly, as it awards several contracts on a verge of returning to the moon. A pair of large silver stainless steel ships, powered by 38 Monster Raptor engines, both more powerful than the Saturn V that flew the Apollo astronauts to the moon, are getting prepared to fly in 2022. Those launches would mark the first vital step in NASA's Artemis program, which aims to return astronauts to the lunar surface by 2025 and create a massive shift and campaign that would allow a permanent presence and base on the moon. Although NASA is preparing to send an uncrewed Orion capsule to orbit around the moon by March or April called Artemis 1, if it goes well, Another uncrewed vessel will be sent by 2024, called Artemis II, after which the crewed mission will be sent by 2025. All this marks a massive step towards SpaceX taking the spotlight and crushing all its competitors in 2022. We are sure you are amazed about all this just as we are, right? What do you think will happen in the space race by the end of 2022? Do you think SpaceX will outshine all its competitors by the end of 2022? Do you think the Starship will be successfully performing its orbital flight test by January 2022? Remember to drop your comments below and let us know what you think about all this.